Hello YouTubers, well today is not going to plan at all. The video that I've just done, uh, which is supposed to be the review for the ProSound wireless microphone, didn't go quite to plan because uh, I soon realised afterwards that I hadn't connected the wireless microphone con uh, properly. The computer, uh, because I'd reset some settings earlier, had disconnected the external microphone socket on the computer and the sound you were picking me up on was the built-in microphone into the Logitech camera, which means that the sound quality was even worse than using this microphone that I, I originally had, this wireless microphone. So that didn't go down to plan, uh, and by the time I'd realised that, I'd already unpacked and done the video for this new microphone, so it wouldn't have been a true comparison video for you. Um, after saying that, I thought, well, it doesn't matter, I'll continue anyway, and I will uh, get myself this microphone, the new one that I want to bought, this uh, Pro Sound. I'll get it all connected up and I'll let you see the quality. And I was going to compare them both. I was going to wire both microphones in for you to, to have a proper, a true comparison. Unfortunately, I couldn't get this to work properly. The sound quality, the audio is extremely low on it. And even though all the settings were pushed up right to the maximum on the computer, you know, the, um, the, the volume adjustment and the input settings and everything else, it just wouldn't do it. Very, very quiet, very, very faint, very, very distant, which is no good for me. Um, I've tried various different settings. I've altered things and tried different microphones and leads. It just won't do it. What I have managed to do, I've got this little amplifier here, which you can plug in, well, side, uh, microphones and, and stuff. Um, and, and I've tried it and it does work, it just doesn't work very well with the computer. As much as I adjusted everything, it won't do it. Um, and I'll be honest with you, even though it did work with the amplifier, I wasn't impressed, I didn't, I didn't like it. The sound quality seemed quite, um, quite cheap and it faded in and out. If you were moving around a room, even though I was only two or three feet away from the, uh, the receiver, uh, you'd get this, this shadowing uh, effect, you know, where it hisses in and out of frequency. Um, even though I thought the idea of having two antennas like this, either side, was to prevent that from happening, but it didn't. Um, and, you know, if, if that's the, the problem you have close up range, what's it going to be like when you've got uh, a bit of a further range to record? So, all in all, I'm not impressed with it at all. So, apart from the fact that I can't use it on the computer anyway, um, the, 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 the quality is really poor. Uh, I don't think it's um, a broken unit, I don't think it's malfunctioned. I think it's just that, you know, you do get what you pay for at the end of the day. And uh, as much as I paid, um, what, 60 odd pounds for it, um, it definitely is not worth the 60 pounds. The microphone I'm using now at the moment is the original microphone which I've talked about, which is this one here, which is the um, the, the, the Nadi, uh, the Nadi WLT14, is it? Yeah, um, and, and to be honest, you know, this works better. The sound quality is a little bit bassy on it, but that's down, I think, to this microphone that I'm using, this little clip-on mic. It's a very, very cheap one, but it works better than the one I just bought, and it was half the price. Um, just take the camera off. That's the uh, the receiver there uh, for it. It's just got the one single antenna. Um, it's a smaller device, um, but it just does better. Normally, that sits up on the shelf uh, above the computer on the, on the on the bookshelf, so it's normally out of the way. It's just there now because I've been working on it. So all in all. Um, for the moment, I'm going to stick with my existing radio microphone. I'm going to smarten it up a bit. I'm going to buy myself a new clip-on mic that will plug into this transmitter um, and hopefully give me better audio that way. And I think that's the way to go. This, incidentally, this uh, this Nady or Nadi, whatever, uh, only cost me like thirty pounds, and I bought this about twelve months ago from a music place, with some music shop. Um, much better, much better quality, and I can walk around the house pretty much with no hissing and no uh, no fading in and out and you know interference and stuff. So um, unfortunately, Pro Sound, um, 
you know, I'm going to take you back tomorrow. Um, I'm very, very disappointed. Very disappointed indeed. But it's one of those things. Uh, we tried it, didn't work. So let's move on. I think if I was going to upgrade the microphones at any point now, I think I'd probably look at going for the more expensive range uh, where you're looking at sort of UHF frequencies uh, with various different channels and stuff on because they do seem um, to be a lot more accurate and, and better quality. So that's where we are with that one. So this is going to go back tomorrow. Um, I'm going to have a look to see what clip on mics they do to replace this one. Try and get a better one if I can. And uh, look out for the new videos. Incidentally, I am still, like I said before, in the process of getting a new um, camera, uh, a proper camera, rather than this webcam. Um, and, and that should improve things as well. I do ultimately want better audio and better visual as well. So we'll see. Okay, so thanks for watching. Any questions at all, uh, mail me uh, or send any responses back to this video. So happy watching and I'll speak to you soon.